Hey y'all, welcome to Slay the Spire. Today we're playing the daily challenge for June 12th, 2019. The character at the Ironclad and the modifiers are Insanity. Started with a random deck of 50 cards. Light, you may ignore path when choosing the next room to travel to. And Terminal, whenever you enter a new room, lose one max HP. Start each combo with five plated armor. Let's get started. A lot of high scores here, probably a lot of collector bonuses. All right, so the Insanity deck, let's really briefly review it. I see three heavy blades already. Huh. Oh, six perfected strikes. Wow. Um, all right. Okay, I don't see actually too many other strike cards, but uh, six perfected strike, that's that's pretty good. All right, yeah, we'll definitely try to go for as many collective bonuses as possible. It's also with flight, we can get all of the elites this floor, five of them, okay? And then we'll probably also want to maximize question marks. Um, do I actually want to go for regular fights? For example, the second floor, we have the choice of either doing a shop or a regular fight. I'll probably go for a shop then. We don't have that much gold yet. Maybe, is there a better opportunity for a shop? Yeah, there's a shop. You know what? We don't need a shop. I think we have a lot of good cards. So let's just stick with uh, regular fights. That way we can gain more cards. Yeah, 24 damage. That's not bad at all. Unfortunately, we have two uh, body slams and nothing to do with them. So we'll just do a perfected strike for 36. Could have almost killed too. Okay some damage but yeah this is going to be the biggest problem defending um flex clothesline burning pack i definitely saw a burning pact um that itself is not going to be that great though we don't really have any synergies but i think just for the collector bonus i'm already seeing two of them yeah i think that's probably something we'll take then okay All right, i should also before the combat starts um yeah so we have three reckless or perfect strikes reckless charge and war cry in our deck so, okay, so we already have a full collector bonus on Anger, Body Slam. Um, we're one card away from Heavy Blade. And then we need two more Shrug It Off, two more Sword Boomerangs. Uh, we have Warcry, right, in our opening hand? Okay, so four Warcrys already. We have a collector bonus for that. We just need one more Burning Pact. Um, two more Pummels. And two more Sentinels. Okay, alright, so we'll just pick up everything we got. Um, can we kill here? Uh, no, we cannot. Let's see what Warcry gives us. I should put this thing on. 9, 12. Yeah, I don't think we can. Uh, actually, never mind. We can't kill. So, kill you. Reckless charge. Headbutt for a kill. Explosive potion, as well as. Armaments might be nice. We don't need body slams. Uh, disarm. I think I, I prefer disarm, though. Okay, now I think we'll do question marks. Uh, definitely get a curse. Okay, we definitely need 5. Upgrade a card. Well, none of these become innate up an upgrade. I'm really not sure what to upgrade here. Um, I mean, I can only think of the disarm, just... Or maybe metallicize, it is a power. Actually, is it the only power we have? Yeah, oh, I guess we have rupture too, but that's pretty much useless at this point. Um, and, and combust, which is not that amazing. Uh, alright, I think I'll upgrade the, um, the disarm. I mean, chances of us drawing it is, are very low, but might as well. Okay. Here we can do, um... Anger, Perfected Strike, and Wild Strike. Yeah, the first floor is going to be the Breeze. Uh, just perfecting Elites might be a problem. Okay, uh, Seeing Red, Sentinel, or Second Wind. Um, I don't think we have either Seeing Red or Second Wind, so I think we'll go with Sentinel, since I definitely saw a copy of that already. Uh, Lagavulin, I probably should wait. Not sure what I'm waiting for, but let's wait. Uh, yeah, actually, I wouldn't mind waiting for Disarm. Upgrade one, too. Uh, I mean, I'm waiting for something like Metallicize or some some of our other powers, although this would be a pretty good turn to wake him up on, right? 9, 14, another 14. Hmm, I'm not sure. Can there be a better turn? I don't think so. I think this is pretty much the best turn. Maybe, well, we could wait for maybe another power and disarm, but I think we should start waking him up here. Okay, so Heavy Blade, Swift Boomerang, and Clash, Anger. Okay. Okay, 15 incoming. Yeah, good thing we didn't wait, since this is uh, not a great turn. Um, well, probably don't want to play Heavy Blade here, right? Warcry. Um, I'll put the... I'll put the Anger back. Let's Burning Pack the Heavy Blade. Oh, yeah. I was hoping for some defense, but unfortunately, this is a problem, right? There's, It's going to be pretty much impossible to defend against Elites. We have a lot of offensive capabilities, just no defenses. 
And then uh, Whirlwind does 15. That's not enough. Let's do Sever Soul. Okay. Should be able to kill with a good draw. Yep. All right, we got tiny chest up and pick up. Gain 30, per, uh, 30 gold. You are 10% more likely to find treasure in question mark rooms, as well as battle trends. I think in this sort of deck, should I do armaments? Wouldn't be a bad idea. No, let's do battle trends. We definitely need card draw with the amount of cards we have. Okay. Yeah, this one's going to be hard to defend again. Um, Warcry. Yeah, there's nothing I can do here, right? Um, can we kill somehow? We do have an explosive potion. That's 24, so 34, and then we need another 6. Uh, headbutt is 9, right? So 33, 43. That would kill. I guess we have an anger too. Uh, yeah, okay, let's do it, and then we can do uppercut next turn. I mean, it will keep us perfected this turn. Um, okay. Alright, let's see what happens next turn. Alright, so here we can do Clash. Uh, we can kill... Yeah, unfortunately, we can only play one of these cards, and the other one is not... Well, yeah, and we can't perfect... Oh well. Yeah, perfecting will be hard. I think we have to really focus on the collective bonuses here to do well. Okay. Well, should be easy. All right. Got Bag of Marbles as a savage combat. Apply one vulnerable to all enemies as well as... Um, well, we could get 50 points for Reaper uh, for not picking Reaper. I don't think we need Reaper, actually. It's not the card that we really need. Uh, let's do Flex here. And then um, I'll do... What I'll do, I'll go for a shop here. So let's do another question mark. Okay, that's more gold. Very good. Here we get preserved insect enemies in the elite combats have twenty five percent less HP. That's really good for us. Okay, first shop. So I think we'll just go for the uh, well. Hand of Reed might give us gold. Well, we'll well no in a card of in a deck of fifty six, it's gonna be difficult to draw it on time. I don't think we'll go for that. I'll take a block potion for the upcoming elite fight and then um. Auto Lightning, is there a skill that we want to have in our opening turn always? Maybe something like, um... Just saw it. Um... Bot Weakness, just to start off with some strength, if the enemies are attacking. <laughs> Definitely feel no pain, I think that's that's one of the powers that we can rely on. Uh, I kind of want to feel, uh, I kind of want to take all of these. Yeah, Armament, Sever Soul, Hummel, and probably not Entrench though, that's probably the one card we don't want to take. And then probably also not Panacea. Okay, I think I think that's fine. Yeah, the Hand of Greed was a tough decision, but ultimately I think it would be too difficult to draw it consistently. Alright, so Perfected Strike, Anger, one of the rare examples where... Well, not rare examples, but having the spot weakness in our opening hand here doesn't matter. But at least we perfected this one, thanks to Preserved Insect. A Duvidol for each curse in your deck, starts coming with one strength, very good. We do want to pick up curses. I don't want to take more Perfected Strike, so let's go with the Wild Strike. Okay. All right, let's see if we can do anything here. We can do flex and then pummel does 20. Perfected strike does 29. That is really close. Um, and we cannot fully defend, right? All right, well, let's do, let, let's just kill you. And it's such a shame that we're wasting so much damage. But it's okay. All right, so um, another pummel for 12. Let's see who Sword Boomerang hits. Okay, the Frontliner. Draw a card. Clothline. Um, no, I think we'll do... Well... Pummel does 12. Burning Pack. Regular Charge and Pummel together will do 20. That's not enough to kill. Yeah, I just don't see a way to perfect this one again. Alright, let's just do Clothline and Regular Charge. We'll take some damage here, it's okay. Okay. And then here we can do Anger, drag it off, and uh, Uppercut, actually. Be able to kill next turn. Hmm. Yeah, too bad we didn't perfect this one. Bottle Tornado up and pick up, choose a power card, so you come with this card in your hand. That probably should be something like Rupture, and we should upgrade that. The reason I take it is because we don't really have a better power card. Um, here, I'll take an Iron Wave, probably. Yeah. We don't have a more suitable power card, uh, and also once we upgrade it, uh, I want to pick up curses, so we might get curses that um, deal damage to us, and that way that would be an easy way to um, increase our hand size or our, our strength. I mean, okay. I think we can maybe wait for another disarm if we get lucky. 
Or we can wake him up. No, no, this is not the best turn to wake him up. Let's put the pommel back. Okay. Try to wake him up next turn. Oh, have to wake him up this turn. Alright, yeah, fine. Not the best way to wake him up, but sure, better than nothing. Um, we can do Iron Wave and Anger. Okay. We do have a Block Potion that might be useful. Uh, there's Pummel again for 12. 17. Okay, I think we'll do Heavy Blade, Wild Strike. There is a reasonable chance of killing, so I'll fully defend here with the Block Potion. Okay. And then here we can kill. Awesome. Perfect. This elite as well. We got Molten Egg. Whenever you add an attack into your deck, upgrade it. Very nice. Uh, Reaper would be upgraded, but again, I don't see a big point in it. Let's take Anger instead. Okay, lost question mark. Um, well, definitely don't need to heal. Uh, what do I want to remove from our deck? Nothing really. I probably clicked on that too, a little prematurely. Um, is there anything that's really useless? I mean, I'm bust. I'm not a fan. Although, with the Rupture together, not actually a bad idea. Because it'll give us strength. Yeah, I shouldn't have removed the card. I should have just skipped this uh, this event altogether. Well, if we have to remove a card, I'll remove a uh, Warcry since uh, it's not really useful. But yeah, I should have just uh, skipped that event. And then here, let's upgrade the, um, the card that's in our opening hand, Rupture. Okay. We also have lost a little bit more HP because now he's going to do a big attack. So let's do Rupture, Clothline to weaken him next turn, and then um, just Body Slam for one damage. Just to see what Power Push we get here. 24 incoming. Probably the most defensive card we can get. Um, let's do Brutality. That'll basically give us a lot of strength. Okay, and then um, let's do Metallicize, Warcry. Um, yeah, no, nothing we can do here. So just both sentinels, but uh, we're still gonna take a bunch of damage. I guess I could have drank the skill potion. We need, we didn't need that much more defense. Yeah, that might have been a mistake. The spot weakness, thunderclap, pummel for a lot of damage. Since we're not perfecting, I don't care about. It. Well, I guess we're still fully defended, right? Okay, feel no pain. Uh, another pummel. And let's work boomerang. Heavy blade was doing 32. I probably should have done that. Right. And then here we can do Flex, Pommel Strike, Anger, Perfected Strike for 35. Like that. Yeah, this one, I wonder if it could have been perfected. Yeah, probably could have. Oh well. Should be able to kill here. 24 is this. Okay. Alright, so Feed, Reaper, and Berserk. I think Feed would be worth it. Getting max HP, even though it's hard to draw in a big deck. Uh, I think it is worth it, so we'll take it. And then I wouldn't mind the energy, but no, no, we should definitely go with Calling Bell. Up and pick up, obtain three cursed and three relics, which means three extra strength, as well as uh, three cards closer to the, um, what do you call it, curse modifier. And we got Pain, which with Rupture together will uh, will be pretty good. Give us some strength. We got Red Skull. While your HP is at or below 50%, you have three additional strength. Running to the Kedron is if your HP is full, gain energy to start your turn. And Mango, up and pick up, raise your max HP by 14. All of those are really good. Okay, so let's see if we can maximize elites here. One, two, three, four. Yeah, again, can hit all of the elites. Perfect. And then, yeah, we'll do question, we'll do question marks. And yeah, this pot, I think we'll go for the shop instead of the regular fights. All right, so um, yeah, not a great opening hand. Let's burning pack the decay out. Okay, and then we can do shrug it off, and probably just do sever soul for thirty. Okay. Yeah, we're losing the Runic Duke Edron benefit. So this does 24 damage. That'll kill. Let's actually do Thunderclap first. Then Pummel for 36. Well, actually, you know what? Let's kill you and almost kill you. Okay. Be able to kill fairly easily here. All right. Uh, twin Strike, Battle Trance, Pummel Strike. I'll take another Pummel Strike to make the Perfected Strikes a little stronger. Um, I don't think we need anything. We'll save it for the upcoming shop. Oh, well, there is a shop there. Uh, I wouldn't mind the uh, extra max HP, though. Not necessarily the heal, but the max HP will be great. I would love all of the cards, though, but... Yeah, I think the cards might be more important. We'll probably get 20, uh, 25 relics, so we don't need extra relics. Yeah, let's take Rupture. Whenever you lose HP from a card, gain one strength. We already have that. 
Drag it off we have, Clash we have, Thunderclap we have. Probably don't need a trench. And I'll take a block potion that might help with uh, an upcoming elite. So now, since we're already since we don't have any gold left, we'll we won't go to the shop anymore. All right, so this arm, I uh, should have done rupture first. Doesn't matter too much. Um, no defense here. We'll just do pummel. Okay. Okay. Fix incoming. Um, heal no pain. Palace size and another pummel. Big attack, let's do flex spot weakness war cry. And then I'll put the body slam back since we don't really need it. This arm and whirlwind. Okay. And then here we can do Yeah, it's not a great hand here. We can fully defend and I guess do body slams. Alright, let's kill. Okay, uh, upgrade perfect the strike. I'll th I think we'll go with an upgraded whirlwind. The question mark gives another fight. I'm not super happy about the amount of fights we've been getting in question mark rooms. So let's do Thunderclap, Rupture, Pummel does 36 again. We can kill this guy, right? Perfect the strike and Pummel. Okay. It takes some damage, but we should be able to easily heal that back up. Anger, Anger, oh, that. Um, Pummel Strike or Heavy Blade? Um, don't know how many pummel. We'll, we'll take another pummel. Yeah, you know what? No, we'll take another pummel strike, and I'll check next combat how many we have. Okay, will we draw? Okay, so let's see. I picked an anger. Yeah, I shouldn't have done that. We already had a collective bonus. I need that. Uh, okay, so we already have three pummel strikes only, uh, and three heavy blades. Okay, so we just we're very close to a collector bonus there. Let's see what Warcry gives us a uh, sentinel. Um, well, we don't really have a good other way of defending. I'll put the rupture back. Let's actually drink the block potion, then sentinel, flex, and now at least this does a little bit of damage. Ah, almost kills two. Well, I guess we can fully defend by killing this guy. Just wasting a lot of damage though. Okay, we're weakened here. Alright, 19 incoming. Whirlwind will do not enough to kill. Uh, let's do rupture, thunderclap. Not like we really have a choice here. So this will do, what, 8 times 3, 24? Yeah, that won't kill anything. Um, 18 plus another 8 is 30, uh, 26. I mean, do what the Swift Potion gives us. Ooh, feed for 18. Heavy Blade for 29. 29 and 18. Yeah, I think we'll take damage, but I think I, I want to feed on this. I, I, I would, well, could I have to fend it with a Shrug of? No, no, because we're getting attacked by quite a bit, so... I think this is fine. Got some max HP out of it, which is not a bad thing to have. Uh, pummel and whirlwind. Okay, we got Centennial Puzzle. The first time we lose HP each combat, draw three cards. Uh, probably not Searing Blow. Eh, fine, I'll take another war card just for a collective bonus. I'm not happy about it, especially since I removed one last floor. Yeah, this one is going to be really tough. So we have three war cries. Um, this arm is amazing. I'll just get rid of them. Uh, yeah, that wasn't very smart. I have to play this arm. Um, and let's see what skill push we get. Double tap, sentinel, duel. I'll take sentinel just to be able to fully defend. Okay, nine incoming here. Yeah, nothing we can do. Hummel, infected strike, and wall strike. Yeah, it's unfortunate. We just need a tiny bit more defense in our deck. And, um, let's just do Sever Soul. And then Clash and that's what we might for a kill. A bottle flame up and pick up, choose an attack so I should come with this card in your hand. Um I'll take Barricade here. Might come in handy. Uh Bottle Flame, what should be in our opening hand always? Maybe a feed, maybe a whirlwind? Actually a whirlwind wouldn't be a bad idea. Especially if we have a lot of energy. I can't think of another Well, Pummel might be nice since we do have a lot of strength. A good singular attack. Yeah, this is tough. Let's play it safe and take Whirlwind. The other option would also be Feed. Yeah, I should take Feed. Since otherwise we're not guaranteed to see Feed in combat. Whereas this way we're pretty much guaranteed it, even though we won't be able to necessarily always use it. So 36, yeah, here we can actually use Feed. Is there any how else we can do this? So 24, we could also do... 
Well, we could kill this guy, and then 24 plus 16 is 40. Okay, we, we can kill two of them. The pummel, and then reckless charge, feed, and then uh, body slam, but unfortunately we are missing a little bit of defense to be able to protect. Okay. Here we can do heavy blade for 26, and then lost strike for a kill. Yeah, we're really close, just not perfecting everything. We got an old coin up and pick up, gain 300 gold. It's also an attack potion, and I, I'll take another spot weakness. Now we calculate if you end your turn without block, gain 6 block. That's great. Goes well together with terminal. Okay, another shop. Very good. We should definitely take lantern, so I just come up with additional energy. Actually, is that true? Definitely this... Well... It wouldn't help with the collector bonus, but it's a really powerful card. No, I think we should focus on the collector bonus. So we have uppercut and clothesline. We should take more. I don't think we have a single flame barrier or in flame. Let me check havoc. Well, I'll check all of them: flame barrier, in flame, or havoc. I might be blindly going over them, but I don't see them, so I don't think we have any of them. So instead, let's take. Maybe we should just save. Let's take another block potion, yeah, and then save for another shop. I mean, the relics are great, especially Mercury Hourglass, but but um, I think we should focus on the collector bonuses. Okay, we could get another collector bonus out of this, but I don't really want to lose the HP. And we don't really need the bites, so let's skip. And then we don't... Well, we could do another shop. Yeah, sure. We have the gold. Okay, Toxic Egg would be great. Mind Blast is necessary. Um, and we can still afford Toxic Egg, right? Let's take it. So whenever you upgrade... Well, Apotheosis, but we won't be guaranteed to have Apotheosis in our opening hand. So let's take Toxic Egg whenever you add a skill into your deck upgraded. Okay. I know I just said that I shouldn't focus on um, on uh, Relics as much, but... You got Sundial, every three times shuffle you shuffle your draw file, gain two extra energy. That's probably never going to happen. Alright, so let's see. Mind Blast does uh, 78 damage. That's not bad at all. 117, and we can use Feed. Wow, perfect. Good thing to have feed in the opening hand. We got oddly smooth stone, so I just come with one dexterity as well as a fire potion, which I won't take. And um, we don't have any of these, right? I guess I'll take an upgrade in Havoc. And here, let's upgrade. We had another card in our opening hand, right? So Rupture is upgraded. A feed is upgraded. Um, did we have a... I sworn I put a spot weakness in my opening hand. Did I skip that relic? I'm very confused. For some reason, I thought I put a spot weakness in my... Maybe I was offered it and I didn't take it. Alright, fine. Well, we still have to figure out what to upgrade. Um, Mind Plus is already upgraded. I don't know. Barricade? Sure. Make it a little easier to play. Okay. Alright, so this might be a little tough. Uh, let's do... Well, definitely Rupture. And do Uppercut to get rid of the... Um, of the, of the artifact, and then a fear potion and mind blast for 118. Very nice. And then um, let's do feel no pain. Defense might be a problem. Okay. Yeah, we have a lot of attacking here. Good. We only have iron wave, which is not going to make sense since our calcum gives us more block. Um, yeah, I don't think there's much we can do here. 24, 34. So we can't kill the backliner, right? That's 60 damage. Then we still need 14. I guess we have a block potion. Okay, let's do that. So I'll put the spot weakness back. We'll do perfected strike, heavy blade. Okay. And then we have eight. Yeah, let's do the block potion. He took barricade. That's fine. Okay, so here we can do spot weakness. Pummel does 36. I'm not sure how we're going to defend the turn after, though. Um, let's put Shrug it off back, then do Pummel, okay, and then Wild Strike, okay. Alright, yeah, a lot incoming here. Um, so we can gain some strength, right? Let's do Shrug it off once, and then a second time. Okay, we are actually fully defended, right? Yeah, let's kill you. No, let's do Warcry first. Okay, put Injury back. Um, one Anger to kill you. And then Heavy Blade does 47 damage. That's pretty good. And we're fully defended. Worth it. Okay. Alright, now we do need to do 109 damage. So Pommel Strike. Anger. Um, 
Yeah, probably just whirlwind here. All right, this is the moment of truth. Can we do 23 damage? Oh, plus nine. Uh, I think we can. Way more than that. Awesome. Perfected this elite or boss. And I think we'll go with offering. Yep, we'll help with both rupture and energy and card draw. Um, unfortunately, no energy relic here. I think I'll go with Ori then. Yeah, so I'll pick up, choose an add five cards to your deck. Help with the collector bonus, hopefully. Um, hmm. Definitely probably spot weakness there. Let's take another shrug it off. Spot weakness. I'm mostly just looking for collector bonuses, nothing else. Both line. I don't think we have any of these. Well, we already have a collector bonus for a body slam, so I guess I'll take flame barrier just defensively and then here i think we have everything i'll take war cry let me check in the next combat whether we have duplicates all right we have to awaken one which is fine um let me see so i was looking for oh we already have a collector bonus for clothesline what did i draw I draw anything yet okay so then let's see war cry we're missing one from uh, heavy blade and one for um strike we already have it for shrug it off very good uh okay we we probably shouldn't have taken that war cry i just realized we needed two thunder two more thunder strikes and two more wild strikes okay let's keep going um so rupture yeah unfortunately feed is gonna kill here right 127 can we not kill so i, I want to use my feed um yeah 24 that's not good um i mean emulate might kill too right Carnage, Warp Boomerang, 12 for 7. Let's try that. 30, yeah, that's better. Perfect. We want to use Feed as much as possible. We got a Regen Potion, and um, I'll take another Wild Strike. I feel like we need more of those. Uh, probably, is there a shop at the end? Ooh, there isn't. Last shop is this one. All right, we'll, we'll go do that one then. We got Letter Opener. Every time we pay three skills in a single turn, deal five damage to all enemies. Probably won't happen too often for us. Gremlin Horn, whenever an enemy dies, gain energy and draw one card. That's very nice. Okay, this might be the last shop. Uh, so let's be really careful with what we take. Um, I'll take another Havoc. Probably don't need anything else. Maybe Potion Belt? Not super necessary. I mean, might as well. Chances are we're not going to see another shop. So yeah, Potion Belt is up and pick up. Gain two Potion Slots. Can accumulate a bunch of potions for a uh, boss fight. Okay, we still need one more Curse, by the way. All right, Mind Blast, 130, will kill anything. Mm -hmm. Battle Trance gives us a... Uh, sure, do I want to do Offering? Yeah, why not? Actually, that was silly, we can't draw anything. So 40 will kill, and then can I feed here? 55, no, wait, uh, 40... Yeah, let's do Pummel, a Perfected Strike, and then Feed. Awesome. Got Gambler's Brew, and uh, I'll take another Battle Trend just for the Collector Bonus. Alright, first Elite here, the Nemesis. Can we Feed here? 132, and Feed. Awesome. Got Pendip, every 10th attack you play, deals double damage, as well as a second Feed. Yeah. Next Elite. Ooh, this... Well, here we probably definitely not gonna... Um, perfect, uh, not perfect, but um, feed on. Yeah, 146. Let's do an uppercut first, then wall strike, and then a mind blast for 175. Not bad at all. Nine incoming. We are fully defended thanks to the uh, Oricalcum. Uh, so let's do probably just thunderclap and uh, probably just sever soul. No need to do anything else. Could have done a mind, uh, body slam just for fun. Okay, if we get a headbutt, that would be great. Oh, wow. Th thanks, game. Uh, I don't think we can kill here, though, right? So let's make sure we play the headbutt last. Uh, so let's do Pummel Strike. Okay, Anger. Heavy Blade does 46. And then Headbutt does not kill. Very good, we'll put the feed back. And then we're gonna waste double damage with our feed. But that's fine. Alright. Still fed on this guy. We got Anchor, so I just come with one with ten block, as well as yeah, we still needed burning packs, right? And shrug it off, I, I believe. But let's do burning pack. Okay. Alright, here. I wouldn't mind a curse actually. I need a fifth one. I find gold. It'd be upsetting if we don't get a shop after this. Okay. 
Here we've got the boot. Whenever you deal four or less unblocked attack damage, increase it to five. Let's delete. Yeah, we don't even have that. We just have one question mark space left if we don't want to uh, not take an elite. Which I definitely don't want to do since there's a chance that I um, might not have a, have a curse in there. Alright, fed on this guy. We got Mummified Hand. Whenever you play an attack or a power card, a random card in your hand costs zero that turn. As well as a Fear Potion and um, take a Reckless Charge. Okay, here we have to fight a regular enemy. Or boring. Uh, can we feed? So 24, just the 36? Yeah, I think we can. At least on one of them. If we somehow can find another feed, or the other feed, that would be pretty neat. Okay, let's see. Pommel Strike. Uh, War Crime. Drag it off. Okay, and then Havoc. Right, Burning Pack, the other War Crime. Maybe I should just cycle through our cards so we get the other feed. It would be worth it for the max HP. Um, I'm not sure if I want to take damage. Let's do Clothline. Uh, we are fully defended. Okay, let's wait one more turn. Hmm. Huh? Uh, still fully defended, right? Let's see what Havoc gives us. Yeah, that kills. Alright, fine. Uh, feel no pain, definitely. Okay. Next delete. Okay, now feed doesn't work on minions, right? But uh, it does work on this guy. Awesome. We got Art of War. If you do not play any attacks during your turn, gain additional energy next turn, as well as another heavy blade. Yeah, I think we needed one for the collector bonus. Uh, no curses. We had the Calling Bell too. Very annoying. Um, let's do Rupture. Body Slam. You, and then Feed. And then Mind Blast on you. And uh, Thunderclap, shrug it off, shrug it off. Flash. Okay. Got a Blood Potion and uh, Corruption. Yep, definitely. Now we just need to draw it consistently. Ooh, ooh, we can get a curse out of this. Perfect. All right, uh, we might lose HP, but um, could also gain max HP. But no, I do want to get a curse out of this. So um, let's just do uppercut for weakness. Actually, let's do both line for weakness. 24. I'll take 24. Give me my curse. Seven. We need small attacks. Like, um, I guess we don't really have small attacks. Uh, let's see what Wolk Wolkrai gives us. Not a small attack. Um, I'll definitely do Metallicize. Let's do Thunderclap. Yeah, fine. That's probably as small as we can get. Right. Okay, 21. Anger is a very good small attack. Actually, I won't even get through the armor. Let's do Wild Strike first. 15. No, no, no. That, that can't do. Oh, perfect. Okay, okay. We'll, we'll just take... I'll do Fire Breathing, sure. Okay, wow, that was lucky. That's an extra 100 points, so, uh, you know, I think it was worth the wait. Uh, let's do Feel No Pain, Disarm, Body Slam, and Feed. We should have double damaged Feed there. And okay, now now I'm just impatient want to kill him as quickly as possible. Uh, let's do Spot Weakness and Heavy Blade. Okay. And then here we should be able to... 33? No, no. Um, anger... Protected Strike, and, uh, ooh, this does not kill, not good, um, yeah, I mean, I guess we're not killing this turn, yeah, I don't want to risk it, we'll just take the damage head on, okay, should be able to kill here, I mean, right, uh, okay, at least we got the curse out of this. Uh, another shrug it off. I feel like we have enough, so I'll take another wall strike. Okay, um, I actually, I actually am thinking of resting here, just to get extra energy from max HP. I don't think there's anything that we urgently need to upgrade, so let's rest. Okay. So, the best thing to do here is to use feet twice. Not sure if that will be possible, though. Definitely have to use Mind Blast on this guy, right? Uh, let's do Rupture. I don't want to gain a lot of strength. Yeah, why not? Let's do Rupture, and then Burning Pact, the Havoc. No, the Clash, because we won't be able to play it with the Pain in the hand. We can apply Weakness. 
Okay. Definitely want to do my blast though, right? Yeah, 139 damage. Want to play around with that. Okay. Probably do... Let's see what Havoc gives us. Anger, okay. Um, Whirlwind would... No, no, we have to do Clothesline. Yeah. And then... Uh, so now we're fully defended, and then probably double damage Whirlwind, although that's not that strong. Okay. Now, unfortunately, we don't have enough energy for the feed. Let's drink the Blood Potion and... Uh, Anything zero cost. I mean, if we get an anger, no, let, let's keep the um, gambler's for later. We can get the feedback with a headbutt. Okay, so here we definitely want to do no, let's do offering first. Let's kill this guy before we play corruption. No need to give him extra strength. There's a disarm that would, I would like to play. Um, you know, let's do disarm barricade. Um, heavy blade does 50 damage. Both line kills. Okay, and then we gain energy and draw another card. Now we can do corruption and play flame barrier. Alright, so these guys should kill themselves on us. Uh, I don't think I want to draw anything yet. Okay. Alright. Okay, 40 incoming. Mm, that's not good. Not good at all. We throw the fear potion. Definitely want to play... Feel no pain, right? But I'm not... Well, Sever Soul is actually not going to exhaust anything. We only have attack cards. Um, no, we need some defense. I am actually inclined to get rid of everything. Even though we're, we're able to do a lot of damage, but it's not going to uh, kill. I'll keep the uppercut just for the weakness application. Yeah, this is not much better game. Not better at all. Yeah, I don't think we can perfect this one. Down to 30. Yeah, that was a shame. I think we did pretty well. Maybe got a little un unlucky. Maybe I should have um, barricade. I had barricade out. Maybe I should have um, tried to get more more out of it. Um, all right, let's just do uppercut. Yeah, now now that we're not perfecting, I guess we'll not care about the HP. All right, uh, havoc gives us a thunderclap, fire breathing, body slam. Okay. 21 incoming, um, flex, sentinel, probably don't even need sentinel, might as well though. Warcry, cry, probably don't need, actually, yeah, probably don't need body slam here. Effective strike and anger. Yeah, that was a shame. I think we got a little unlucky with that, uh, last elite. Other than that, we did well, yeah, 1602. That's not bad, but definitely can be improved upon. We did get curses, we got 9 collector bonuses, not bad. We perfected 7 out of the 13 elites. And only the second floor boss. Uh, we did get overkill with the mind plus that was easy. Encyclopedia was very easy. And then Mystery Machine, just barely actually. I thought it would be much easier than that. But yeah, we just got we got 16. And then light speed and I like shiny. So overall, not a bad score. I think the curses really saved us. That last fight that gave us the, the extra curse. Let's see how we stand in the overall rankings. Alright, we're 16th right now. It is early in the day, so I'm sure we'll drop down a little more. But uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure we could have perfected the first elite, maybe by, um, or the first boss, maybe by drinking the skill potion. And then the last boss, maybe I should have, um, I should have played the barricade first, and then really gained a lot of block before transforming the enemy. That probably would have been the right choice, but anyway, thanks for watching. Bye.